Among the many other 5-axis tool alignment options that FeatureCam has is the one which is called From Curve. I'd just like to show you quickly how we could machine this part. Let's do a finish machining in a 3-axis simulation. And you'll see with the tool that I have selected here that we're going to get a gouge on the part. You can see here that the holder is colliding with the part in this area. So we'd need to lean the tool away from the part to avoid this collision or use a longer tool. In this case I want to lean the tool away from the part but as you can see the shape is rather complex so we'd have to decide how we're actually going to lean this tool away. And what I'm doing here in fact is I'm going to use this curve above the part and say that the tool axis should lie through that part and pointing towards the surfaces to be machined. So I just open up my feature here, go into my ISO line, go to 5 axis and tell it I want to go from a curve and tell it which curve I want to use. And you will now see that the toolpath inclines through the curve towards the surfaces. And this will get rid of the gouge problem that we had before. So you can see now, rather than the tool being vertical, it's inclined at an angle. it's going to follow effectively the centre line of that groove. You can see the angle changing constantly as it moves along the part there. So it's maintaining the optimum angle to avoid collisions with the part as it machines.